Wherever it's hidden, time to retrieve it. Working on it. And when it's done, he'll be taken care of. I want that progress report by tomorrow morning. I've got some work I need to do. So you've got the rest of the night to yourself. Time's wasting, Mr. Miles. Yeah, yeah, I'm coming. We're nearly done, you know. And then what? You'll see. Maybe they'll even let you watch when it begins. It's not as terrible as you think. Look, I know you're not gonna let me leave. So why not tell me what's going on? Humor me. I'm not an idiot, Mr. Miles. I think you've already learned quite a bit. I don't know what you're talking about. Of course not. All right, let me ask you something else then. Yes? Some of the stuff I'm seeing in the Animus, sometimes it seems wrong. Untrue, like the history is off somehow. It doesn't- It doesn't what, Mr. Miles? Match up with what you read on an online encyclopedia? What your high school history teacher taught you? Let me ask you something. Do these supposed experts have access to secret knowledge, kept hidden from the rest of us? There are books, letters, documents, all sorts of source material from back then. Some of it seems to contradict what the Animus is showing me. Anyone can write a book, and they can put whatever they want on its pages. Anything. <laughs> Used to be we thought the world was flat. Some people still do. Yes, and they publish books about it. Or that the moon landing was a hoax. I believe there's also a book claims the world was created in seven days. A bestseller, too. Where's this going, Doc? The point, I suppose, is that you shouldn't trust everything you hear, everything you read. What's that your ancestors said? Nothing is true. Everything is permitted. Yes, exactly. It's part of what makes the Animus a killer. There's no room for misinterpretation. There's always room. Touché, Mr. Miles. Now that I've answered your question, can we begin? Should you cause a disturbance, it is wise to leave you. Come in, my student. We have much to discuss. We are close, Altair. Robert de Sable is now all that stands between us and victory. It is his mouth gives the orders. His hand pays the gold. With him dies the knowledge of the Templar treasure and any threat it might pose. I still don't understand how a simple bit of treasure could cause so much chaos. The peace of Eden is temptation given form. Merely look at what it's done to Robert. Once he tasted of its power, the thing consumed him. He saw not a dangerous weapon to be destroyed, 
but a tool. One that would help him realize his life's ambition. He dreamed of power then. Yes, I know. He dreamed, still dreams, like us, of peace. But this is a man who sought to see the Holy Land consumed by war. No, Altair. How can you not see when you're the one that opened my eyes to this? What do you mean? What do he and his followers want? A world in which all men are united. I do not despise his goal. I share it. But I take issue with the means. Peace is something to be learned to be understood, to be embraced. He would force it. And rob us of our free will in the process. Strange to think of him in this way. Never harbor hate for your victims, Altair. Such thoughts are poison and will cloud your judgment. Could he not be convinced then to end his mad quest? I spoke to him in my way through you. What was each killing if not a message? But he has chosen to ignore us. Then there's only one thing left to do. Jerusalem is where you faced him first. It's where you'll find him now. Let this final offering lend you strength. Go, Altair. It's time to finish this. The short blade is best for quickly fending off multiple enemies. Safety and peace, Altair. Upon you as well, brother. Seems fate has a funny way with things. So it's true then. Robert de Sable is in Jerusalem. I've seen the knights myself. Only misfortune follows that man. If he's here, it's because he intends ill. I won't give him the chance to act. Do not let vengeance cloud your thoughts, brother. We both know no good can come of that. I have not forgotten. You have nothing to fear. I do not seek revenge, but knowledge. Truly, you are not the man I once knew. My work has taught me many things, revealed secrets to me. But there are still pieces of this puzzle I do not possess. What do you mean? All the men I've laid to rest have worked together, united by this man. Robert has designs upon the land. This much I know for certain. But how and why, when and where, these things remain out of reach. Crusaders and Saracens working together? They are none of these things, but something else. Templars. The Templars are a part of the Crusader army. Or so they'd like King Richard to believe. No, their only allegiance is to Robert de Sable and some mad idea that they will stop the war. You spin a strange day. You have no idea, Malik. But tell me where they've been seen. I should be after him before he slips away. Three places I can say for certain. 
west of here near both a guard tower and a hospital, and to the southwest at the Church of the Holy Sepulchre. See what you can learn. I will do the same. I'll be quick as I can. Stay safe, my friend. Brother, have you found him? No, not yet. And what of your efforts? He's still here, that much I know. Where he's hiding or what he plans, these remain mysteries to me. I'll continue my search then. Fortune favor you. God save him. Why would anyone want to do that? What is he doing? Oh, 
Kaçın, kaçın, geri dönecek. I trust you're here for the funeral. Or for Robert, rather. I've kept my eyes and ears open, but I've nothing to report. Things are quiet here. Perhaps Tariq has seen or heard something you can use. He's stationed not far from here. Go to him. See what knowledge he has. No, please don't leave! Just a few points. Ah! <laughs> 
find a way to repay this kindness, I swear it. Safety and peace, Master. Have you seen all the vile Templars in town? I have been ordered to kill as many as I can before the burial of your latest victim, Mudged Udin. I am sure if it were your mission, it would be done in no time. I have learned much while looking for those Templars. I will share valuable information with you when you get back. من الذي فعل هذا؟ أخبرني. أدعنا. أين المسؤول عن هذا؟ allowed to be here. between all men. Embrace these Christian soldiers as you would a brother. Welcome them with open arms. In this way, we might forgive the sins of the past and bring about a better tomorrow. We must be strong, we must be brave, and we must find the courage to face those we once called our enemies and now instead call them friends. The Crusaders come to Jerusalem, bringing with them an opportunity to end the fighting, to stop the war. That we may stand as one, we must not turn them away. Oh, <laughs> 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 
Words are hollow. No, I speak the truth. Why would you say other? You're a Templar. So I am. Then you are also a liar and a fraud, just like your master. Where is he? What does he intend? It's peace he seeks, I swear it. And the proof is in his actions. A Christian at a Muslim's funeral. We want an end to all of this. Only because it serves your needs. But this is a noble thing we want. The land will be united beneath our banner. United through force. You'd enslave us all. It is for the best. No, it's not. And so long as my brothers and I breathe, you will not succeed. Altair, my friend. You must help me. Malik has tasked me with killing several archers posted in the region so that our brothers might move around more easily. Normally, it wouldn't be a problem, but this funeral has everyone on edge. The city guard has dispatched its best men to keep the peace, and I simply don't have the skill to remove them. I'd ask two favors of you then. First, to kill the bowmen, and second, do not tell Malik of my failure. In exchange, I'll see what I can learn of Robert's plans.
must help me deal with the archers, or there's no telling what Malik will do to me. Kill him! You'll never get the win! Come out and fight! You'll never get the win! You're mine! Power! Here! He's over here! Come back here! You can't escape! I'm forever grateful for your aid. Malik would never have forgiven me. Here's what I've learned. For a man such as myself, a direct assault in the cemetery would be impossible. There's simply too many guards. Instead, I'd look to blend in with the scholars who are sure to be in attendance. It may not be the most direct approach, but it's certainly safer. Who? Who did this? No, please 
don't need. like a child. A few coins. All I ask is for a few coins. There is no reason for good. No, you... My family is sick and... Could you spare a few coins? He's someone! this. Thank <laughs> you. 
I know now why I joined our clan. Just to be in your presence is a gift from God. This is what I have learned about Robert's men. They are well prepared for battle. To fight them all at once would be unwise. Better to let them chase you for a while before striking back. But it is disrespectful for me to tell a master how he should behave in combat. Forgive me, master. <laughs> 